Good morning viewers today i am present before you with another topic on the play the tempest by william shakespeare in today's podcast i will be talking about the importance of the mask in the tempest before i begin the podcast it is advisable that you keep a notebook and a pen so that you can jot down the important points relating to this particular topic it is further advisable to use earplugs for listening to the podcast so here i begin a mask is a dramatic composition consisting of declamation and dialogue music and dancing decoration and scenery etc in elizabethan times it was not usually performed by ordinary actors but was mostly played by the members of the nobility sometimes even the king and the queen take part in it masks were a favorite form of entertainment at queen elizabeth's court during the reign of james 1 and of his successor masks became even more popular several elizabethan dramatists wrote masks but the mask reached perfection in the hands of ben jonson other well known authors of masks were fletcher chapman decker and campion the principal features of a mask are first the subject was generally allegorical and mythical two the characters were generally gods and goddesses of ancient mythology or personification of such qualities as delight grace love sport and laughter third the duration of a mask was shorter than that of a regular drama Fourth the mask was written in rhymed verse fifth the object of a mask generally was to celebrate marriages in high society in other words a mask was presented on the occasion of a wedding in high society very costly scenery and costume were employed mask in the tempest the tempest contains a mask in act 4 it possesses the following features first it is performed in honor of a marriage the forthcoming marriage of ferdinand and miranda two it is written in rhymed verse three it takes place in the open air and the characters are mythological four the whole piece is rightly termed a majestic vision harmonious charmingly fifth nymphs and reapers dance in handsome costumes thus presenting a lovely pageant The merits of this mask have been variously estimated. One critic says that it is weak th- throughout, that it is faulty in rhymes and in its mythology, and that it is against the grain. Another critic says that there is not much meaning in this mask, while still another critic declares that this mask is preeminent in its lyric beauty. The fact of the matter is that Iris's opening speech in the mask is almost prosaic. with its detailed catalog of country products and scenes but the lines describing venus and her son contain some charming images of course it would be wrong to assume as has been said by some that this mask was written not by shakespeare himself but by some other hand the mask in act 4 is closely connected with the story of the play in so far as it is related to the betrothal and forthcoming marriage of the young lovers Besides this mask serves another purpose it allows time for the ripening of Caliban's conspiracy against Prospero there is yet another explanation of this mask as the tempest was acted on the occasion of the marriage of princess elizabeth in 1613 the mask in the play and the betrothal of ferdinand and miranda may have some reference to the royal wedding the view that the structure of the play generally is conditioned by the mask must be briefly considered Furthermore it had become fashionable to include some mask like entertainment in plays in order to satisfy the growing desire of the audience for novelty and spectacle Thorndike went so far as to regard the whole of the tempest as a kind of adapted mask whose chief interest resided in the opportunities it gave for music and dancing and the lavish use of scenic and mechanical display important as these were it seems incredible that anyone could regard the tempest as a vehicle for display and nothing more 
it is also difficult to see in the hunting of the conspirators by prospero and ariel a formal anti mass miss wellsford suggests that the tempest was influenced by certain particular masks the dances and music she takes to be reflections of mask influence and the caliban plot a johnsonian anti mask translated into dramatic terms in fact the whole plot of the tempest is based upon two motifs used by johnson in the mask of beauty the motifs of wandering and of disenchantment miss wellford's theory that the play is more a dramatized mask than a venture into classical dramatic structure takes insufficient account of the fact that the play is divided into five acts in accordance with contemporary theory and that its action proceeds in accordance with the scheme of classical development one cannot deny a general influence of the court mask however it is also clear that shakespeare in this play reverts to something like the formal structure which he used with varying degrees of success in his earlier attempts at romantic comedy in the comedy of errors he had incorporated in his plotin scheme a romance plot and in most of the other early comedies he experimented with the five act structure the tempest insists on its observance of the unity of time with less obtrusiveness it also conforms with the academic theory of action the first scene is like a prologue and with the second we are plunged straight into a protasis the tempest hence is one of the most economically constructed of all shakespeare's plays he was able to present the redemptive achievement of prospero as a single magical operation in five phases and to give maximum import by the concentration of his method to the interrelationship of event and character since an intensive form was needed shakespeare returned naturally to the five act structure which he had learned in his youth and as in the past he had manipulated it to serve special purposes without abandoning its basic pattern so now he was able to incorporate into it the spectacular elements of the third act and the atmosphere of the new tragic comedy so this was all about how the play uses the idea and element of mask i hope this podcast proved to be of help to each one of you please mention your observation and questions in the comment section below please do like share and subscribe to the channel and don't forget to click on the bell icon for latest update thank you for your valuable time here's wishing you a great day ahead